Today is the feast day of St. Therese of the Child Jesus and the Holy Face, who is the co-patron of the Apostleship of Prayer. Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki, the U.S. Director of the Apostleship, and St. Therese is a special favorite of Pope Francis. When he flew to Brazil for World Youth Day in 2013, he took along a book about her entitled Therese of Lisieux, The Fascination of Sainthood, Secrets of a Rediscovered Doctrine. Pope Francis has said that when he is worried or concerned about a particular problem, he often brings it to St. Therese who, before she died, said that she would spend her heaven doing good on earth and would let fly a shower of rose petals to prove it. How has that promise been kept? Well, in 1925, the year she was canonized, Jesuit Father Pudigan began a novena to St. Therese asking for something very important. He also asked for a sign to know whether his prayers had been heard. He asked for a rose to be sent to him. He didn't tell anyone about the novena or about the request, but shortly thereafter, a nursing sister brought him a white rose and said to him, Saint Therese sends you this rose. Speaking to two journalists when he was the Cardinal Archbishop of Buenos Aires, Pope Francis showed them a picture of Saint Therese and a vase with white roses in front of it. He told them, whenever I have a problem, I ask the saint not to solve it, but to take it into her hands and to help me accept it. And I almost always receive a white rose as a sign. Notice, Pope Francis doesn't expect that every problem he brings to Saint Therese will be solved, but he's sure that every prayer is heard and will be answered in the way that is best.